is on the back side of the grip because everything we do, we're trying to support impact. So when we do this, we're also using our pivot to help support impact. And in your swing, you know that this isn't the case. Your swing, it's this kind of move. And, you know, for a fit guy, relatively decent size, you don't hit it very far. So let's support impact with your pivot. So here's a drill I think it's going to help. What we're going to do is to go ahead and take our dress hands alignment, so mid-body hands, understanding where impact is, and we're going to get our we're going to get our hands in front of our body with our elbow in front of our right hip bone, and just feel what it's like to pivot your body, feeling like your right hip bone and elbow are connected, and you can you can pivot this motion. What I'm doing here is I'm letting my body support my arms into impact. So the drill looks a little something like this. I've got a 7 iron here, and it's the first swing in the morning. So I'm going to make a little motion to kind of set my hands, pivot, and hit a little shot. It is to feel how our body can help put some pressure into our arms, into impact. And when we do this, go ahead and pivot and stop with the club out here in front of your left toe with those grooves relatively square to your target line still. And you'll really see a different relationship between your dress hands and your impact hand. The sensation is that this right hip joint is going to help this long because right now you've got this going on. We want to feel, and I've even done this where I've taken a rubber cord and I've attached a dowel and I've got my swing going down in front of me and then support that impact with pivot as opposed to getting behind it. Okay.